Hello and welcome back to LP's LP of Banjo Tui. Last episode we got couples of uh, jiggies. Couples of jiggies. Yes, we got two jiggies in one episode. It was great because they both came like at the exact same time. Anyways, this episode maybe we can match that level of success and we're starting off here inside the mountain. I'm not actually certain what we can do here and it doesn't look like there's a whole lot we can do anyways. We can split up into two. Or we can go back outside and see where exactly we are, because we came down from the ceiling, essentially. Uh, we had fought Terry, the pterodactyl parent, and there was another exit that sent us down into the mountain. So we are back on the ground floor. Oh, I remember where we're at. Yes, yes, yes. We're close to Mumbo. Close to Mumbo indeed. Beautiful. And there's another egg. We need to find all of Terry's eggs. There's four of them. Oh, my God! The freaking dinosaurs here. <laughs> oh, that thing is running up the front and side of the wall trying to get at me. Uh, we need to find all of those eggs. There's four of them. I know where two of them are, but I don't think we have the move required to do anything about it just yet. Uh, we do have a switch we can use with Mumbo, though. Uh, if we go turn into Mumbo or enlist Mumbo's help or whatever you want to call it, we can make Humblewumba's wigwam swell in size. Yeah, we figured this out last time. The creature that Humblewumba turns us into is a T-Rex, and obviously a large T-Rex is going to be capable of uh, <laughs> different things than a small T-Rex. So we're going to do that now. All right, Humblewumba, make me a big lizard. Oh, buddy, I'm excited. You know, the T-Rex is uh, probably the most common favorite dinosaur of most people. Not mine, I don't think so. Daddy teeter. Oh, call me daddy. Use the control stick to move and B to make much noise. My God. Terrifying. Yeah, no, uh, I... Uh, <laughs> horrifying. Uh, if I must say, your scientists were so preoccupied with whether or not they could, they never stopped to think if they should. And for that, I guess I'm thankful, because now we can go press this giant switch. You know, look at that. This is for me. Ooh, we get the ginge! Do we have to go change into the bear, or can we just, like, grab this with our foot? Oh, we have to do it. We have to... It gives us 30 seconds to go change back into the bear. Well, I've already squandered that opportunity, so I'm gonna... have myself a snack. Oh, goodness gracious. We stepped on our meal. How sad. No matter. We'll go up here and now can we yell at the the things here? Open up! Open these doors, they're for me! Maybe not. How do we open that? Yeah, I'm so sorry. Back into prison with you, little Ging. Okay. So we, we know there's that, that we have... To... Oh, buddy, we have fallen. We have fallen. Okay. Well, I guess we could explore and see what what this demon is capable of. What's up here? Oh, there's a rock we need to go break. There's the burden bear. Okay. Didn't notice that to begin with. But there has to be more that Daddy Dino here is uh, capable of. More than, than freeing a Jinjo, because that doesn't seem like a great use of his skills. Can he eat these dudes? Can we get them, like, out of here and get the, get the Jiggy to their garden? I don't know how we would even get up there, so maybe not. We'll just take a romp. Yeah, and we can't even get this. Look at that. Maybe we need to get it while flying. Uh, Terry, last episode, unearthed or spawned or what have you, a couple of flight pads for us. So we'll have to... I think one's actually on top of this spire right here anyways. So we'll have to use that accordingly. Uh, there's some captives. Interesting. Oh, oh, look at that. There's a little tiny opening there, probably for the the timer chicken or whatever, the little little time bomb. Hmm. Hello there, bird. Eyeing me down. I don't know that I can tightrope this very well, but we're going to try. You're trying. <laughs> that thing dive-bombed me and killed itself on my hide. What are you thinking? Take advice from the... Oh, God, it's the Stegosaurus? Is that what they're called? Take advice from the Stegosaurus and avoid me. Okay, well, I don't necessarily have any idea what I'm doing as Daddy Dino right now. 
So I'm gonna go. Can I go back? Oh. Oh no, maybe this is how the dinosaurs became extinct. Oh no, there's a there's a here we go. This is a walkway. Perfect. Well, maybe. It's slightly less than perfect, but still acceptable. Uh, anyways, we're gonna we're gonna do the thing with the Jinjo, and then we're gonna be back at square one essentially. I really, really, really thought that we'd have more going for us as Big Daddy Dino here, but it would seem that that well, what's over here? This is a big chasm. <laughs> Oh, I, 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 oh, no, 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 that's where we were. That's where we were. Don't need to be, well, maybe. No, 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 don't second guess yourself now, LP. Press the button, and we'll see if we can do this in 35 seconds or less. I feel like that's going to be easy, because it, it's going to stop the timer, one, when we're going through these screens, right? Like, it's not still running. Or was it? And it's not running while we're, while the magic's happening, right? It's, it stopped at 29. And I have to imagine it's going to... Still be at 29, right? 28, yeah, 27, 26, 25 when we get out of here, or is it running while it's dark? Uh, 24, 23, yeah, okay, so I guess it doesn't move. Any which way, that means we get to free the Jinjo, and you better be someone worth freeing. Are you going to assault me? Okay, we had to, we had to test it out. <laughs> Just roll into them. If they're good, they won't be hurt. If they're bad, well... They had it coming anyways. Okay, so next up on the agenda, we're going to go back over to Mumbo's place because there is that rock off on the ledge. We can actually see it from here. It's right over there that needs to be broken. Uh, fingers crossed that it's a jiggy. I mean, I seriously, seriously doubt that it's a jiggy, but that would be the ideal situation. If it's not going to be a jiggy, then fingers crossed that it's a move. Chiefly, the move that... Kazooie needs to learn for us to help these eggs. Now, don't don't knock me into the swamp, bro. Just, come on, man. Nope, 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 nope. Not, not having it. Okay, not today, not now, not ever. I have a date with this here boulder. It's a nice boulder. I'd very much like to destroy it because that's just how nice it is. <laughs> All right, we missed. Great. Let's try it one more time. And what do we have? We have a Cheeto Scroll. Okay, well, that's not really on my list of things that I wanted it to be, but whatever. It's something for our efforts, and for that, I am thankful. Let's go back inside the mountain. Get out of here, Stegosaurus. Don't you remember me? I was the giant T-Rex. I'll remember this. I'll remember how you pursued me. So when I'm big again, I'll come kick you around like a little football. Anyways, uh, I feel like there's more things for us to adventure forth with in here. Uh, there is a... something over there. See that? I mean, uh, it's just a flight thing, which I guess could help, right? Maybe it could get us on top of this spire? The very, well, can we drain this water? There's like a pathway down there or something. It's interesting. There's a Cheeto scroll back behind that one. Hmm. Yeah, there's no way we can propel ourselves up high enough to get to that uh, boots without this flight thing. Can we get up here? We can. Oh, great. Didn't get any red ones, but I don't think we needed any anyways. It's fine. Now, what ha what's up here? Nothing. We don't, we don't want to be up there. It's over here. Hmm. Hmm. Doesn't seem like there's much of anything here for us. Let's get a little bit higher. Uh, so that's where we were. That's where we came from when I was talking about Terry's thing. If we go all the way up. That's where the jiggy was. The, the second jiggy from last episode. Interesting. Oh, what do I see with mine eyes? What is this? This ledge. Uh, that's the ledge we hopped off. Okay, absolutely useless. <laughs> uh, and then this. The spire. The spire is nothing, too. Oh, hold up. Chomposaurus. Stomach cramped carnivore. What just happened? <laughs> I did a ground pound on top. What's going on? <laughs> We're getting assaulted with two boss fights in the same place, or what? I thought there was only one boss per stage at most. This guy doesn't even want to speak to us. Oh. Oh. Okay, well. We've been consumed, and we inside Chompa's belly. Can you hear me in there? 
I won't digest you if you help me out with my little stomach problem. I want to hear what you've got to do. Yeah, dude, I'd love to. I'd love to help you out with your virus. Th those are the blue ones. The nasty Blarg ulcers. Keep appearing in my stomach lining. They really hurt. I want you to shoot them before they disappear again. Blue ones are worth three. Green ones are worth two. And red ones one. Oh my goodness, look at me. I have this down pat. Okay, so we got to score 75 points worth of healing in his stomach. We don't need to absolutely solve his problem. He just needs 75 points of it being done with. And we have infinite, infinite eggs, so let's just spray it. All right, we can Rambo size all we need here. And I don't think they're going to actually hurt us either is the thing. They look pretty offensive. They have huge mouths and they do some weird unhinging of their jaws. I'm not sure what that's about. <laughs> Makes me a little uncomfortable. They're a little bit too capable in that regard, but it's fine. Anyways, like I said, I don't think they're downright offensive to us. They only hurt the poor demon monster lizard that they're inside of. So we can just, yeah, spray around do a little bit like this. Honestly, dude, we could cure your whole problem. We don't even have to stop at 75. You give us some sort of time limit, which is weird if we're helping you, which we've hit the, uh, the 75 now. And it's honestly a little closer than I thought it was going to be. Uh, we're, barely, we're not going to get 100, which I thought we were for sure going to get over. But hey, this is still, well, we might get 100. Mm, we got close. We got close. I'll take that. What is 95 if not 5 less than 100? I swallowed this awful thing earlier. I thought it was a biscuit, but it was made of gold. Please take it with you when you leave. I'll take the golden biscuit from you, buddy. I appreciate that. You gotta risk it to get the biscuit. Do you want to play again? You know, I, I don't. I'm sorry. You're gonna have to deal with your little parasitic friends uh, yourself. But you're huge. You're down 95 of them. You should be doing just fine. You know, maybe I could bring back some Pepto-Bismol or some other sort of stomach solution and you'll be doing even better. Goodness, salivating quite a bit there. Yikes. Very, 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 very gross. Okay, well, now that we have spent the uh, proper amount of time in yet another monster's belly, we can exit this place. I'm not... These things intrigue me. Why do we want to split up? Why do we want to split up? I don't know yet, so I'm not going to do it. But that's, mm, that's weighing heavy on my mind. And now, what? That is the question, because we have done three, or we've acquired three Jiggies. There is a fourth Jiggy to be had that we know of, uh, and that is involving the eggs. But how do we do that? Don't know. Uh, and, and what else is there to do? Don't know. We do know, I guess, that there is a flight pad on top of what? This spire? Potentially this spire? One of the spires? So I suppose that's my next move, is to, to try and get in the air. <laughs> we'll get in the air and we'll fly around and see what that does for us. Hopefully, I mean, it will do something, right? I, I say hopefully it does something for us. Undoubtedly it will. I just don't know how much. And it looks like I was wrong. That is not the spire with the flight thing. We can go over here? No, not quite. Okay, uh, excuse me, don't. No, please don't. Please, please don't, goodness gracious. <laughs> They're not even subtle about it. There's not even like a sneaky little, I'm gonna trip you or I'm gonna nibble on your Achilles. It's like, I wanna put my friggin' dinosaur shoulder right in your backside. How do you like them apples, huh? You don't. They're not apples, you hate them. So it's right over there. How do we get over there? How do we get over there? Hmm. Let's do some investigation here. And then there's all this, actually. This is a thing we can mess with. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Oh, springy shoes. Springy shoes. I see. I see the route to that flight thing. There it is. Beautiful. But first, before we do that, might as well send in a little reconnaissance soldier here to see what they can get into. I mean, they can get into this wall, but <laughs> let's see what that actually does for us. Will it bear fruit in the way of a jiggy? Probably not. But at the very least, I have to imagine we can... Oh, okay, we're running out of time. We got 20 seconds. Let's go in here since we know that the Jinjo's in here. 
You come with us, buddy. Can, wait, can the little, the little chicken, can he acquire? Oh, what? The cracker? Disturbing. That doesn't make any sense. You'll never get dirty if you make this time. We got big time anyway. How is it that one? I went to the left. Didn't I? Let's try that again. I feel like, mmm. As we're coming out of this, and immediately to our right is the tribe member, and immediately to the left would be the Jinjo. Yeah, I definitely went this way. So that leads us not where we want to go, so we'll skip over that. And we can't go in there. That's weird. Grab some eggs. Perfect. We needed another one of those times. Oh, we only got six seconds left. Golly gee williker. Uh, we go in here. See what this is. This is the one immediately to the right. If this is the one with the Jinjo, then nothing makes sense. <laughs> then nothing makes sense. What is this? No, we're outside. All right, well, we blew up. Okay, let's go into this one. What if we do this? We have yet to enter this hole. What is this hole? What fruits are in this hole? Normally, you don't find fruits in holes. You just find worms and dirt and other filth, but these holes are special holes. So we go this way. Hmm. This is all very strange to me. <laughs> I don't understand anything. This is the one we came in. And then I he I hear the baby crying out for, for, for love and affection, but how can we how can we hope to ever help him out with this problem? Not like that. Not like that. None of nothing makes sense. Nothing makes sense. Okay. Uh, there were some more. And don't worry, Jinjo. I'm not. I'm not leaving you to die. We will find a way to help you out here in a second. But I did see there were. But I did see there was some more entry points up here. So what do we have? Uh, one, two. Was there one back here? No, there was not. So we got one, two, three. Four. Uh, well, actually, hold up. This one looks to be a dead end one. Yeah, that's a dead end. That is an entrance. That's an entrance. And that's a dead end. So the center two ones are actually entrances, and the outer two are dead ends. But what's up here? Is there anything, anything for us this direction? No, nothing at all. This doesn't make any sense over here, so we're just going to go back, sit in front of the middle two... Let's go, little soldier. What do we have on level two? Oh, wait, that's a that's a dead end too. Okay, interesting. It looked like a, it looked like it went through to me, but apparently I was wrong. These things happen. I'm wrong all the time. God knows. <laughs> uh, uh, this is what is going on? This sent us back down. I don't even under friggin' stand anything anymore. I don't. What? What the chickamongus diddly dum? Okay, I see what's happening now. We're not going through the wall into like another room. We're going d up and down. I see what's happening. Oh goodness me, that was it took me a minute to figure that one out. Uh, so if we go all the way back over here, did we ever go through this one? Yeah, we can't because that's not even a thing. And this one is the one we just came from, and this is not a thing. This one sends us downstairs. Right? I mean, they all send us downstairs, technically, but this one sends us, yeah, right over here. Okay, so we are spitting our tires trying to help you, Jinjo. You are not having a great time, I imagine. <laughs> uh, that's... Mm. Oh, Jesus. Do you even have a hole in here? You do. You do. And we've only got four more little eggs to help you with, and I don't even think that I'm going about this the right way. There's gonna be like one off somewhere weird, like over here or something. Maybe not. Hmm. What about this one? What about this one? All the way to the right. Have we tried this one yet? This looks peculiar to me. I don't think we have because, I mean, on the surface, it didn't seem to make sense to me. But, survey says it was the right friggin' one. We've got all of the orange Jinjos. The Jinjo family is complete. All two of them. We've got 200% of the white family. 
We get a Jiggy as a result. I don't... Do we get the Jiggy now, or do we have to go redeem it? I think we have to go redeem it. Let me just double check my... I don't know. I don't even know what my count was at. <laughs> well, either which way, that's the equivalent of a Jiggy, so I feel good about that. And now, we take to the air. Uh, well, we take to the air with the backflip, then we also take to the air with the springy shoes, because that's going to propel us upwards, and then we also take to the air by way of this pad. Beautiful. So what can... Oh, no, no, I don't want to do that. Uh, not, not the goal. Uh, what can we get into here? Anything particularly insightful for us? We can go hang out with Terry again. Hmm. I don't know that that's what I want to do. Uh, here is... What is this Colosseum-like structure? This, like, wide open space. We could fly in this hole. What is that? Is this another boss fight thing over here? This is interesting looking. Let's get in the massive hole and see what that does for us. Absolutely nothing. Okay, let's get out of the massive hole. What's down here? Where are we? Where are we? What is going on here? What is this pit? Uh, go down here. Whee! Uh... Oh. Well, this is not ideal. Oh, there's a Cheeto scroll. How do we even hope to get that? We gotta, like... No, I was gonna say we gotta run on the walls, maybe, and, and jump off it, but that's not... Not the thing. Uh, can we even leave? Did I cheese myself into someplace I'm not supposed to be? We can probably walk up this. Yeah! Yeah, this is fine. Oh, hey! What's up, dude? <laughs> Dippy, seeker of beverages. Interesting. I'm so thirsty. I need water badly. Why not go and look for something? It's not going to just drop out of the sky. The sun burns, poor Dippy. So I must stay in my cave. Please get me a drink. It's like bourbon on the rocks. Okay, uh, so we gotta we gotta hydrate the lizard. I don't know how we're gonna go about that. We gotta like reroute the waterfall or something. Hmm. That doesn't make any sense. There's no water nearby here at all. Well, we'll bridge that. Come when we cross to it. Uh, now we gotta go all the way back to where the. The flight thing was because we didn't really do anything at all from from it. We we got no return on our time investment, but I think thankfully we're close by. Well, hey, look at this. There's another rock to break. We'll just do this since we're here, and I don't even actually know where the uh... oh the flight thing is. Maybe there's one right here. I mean that'd be super duper convenient. No, just some notes, which I guess is cool too. Okay, well, if we, you know, we're gonna need the, we're gonna need a move here eventually. At least we'll have the notes to, to acquire it. I actually know where we're at. This is fine. It's right over here. Well, not right, right over here, but once we get through this little bit, we gotta go around the river bend, and then we'll be back met with the, first, the, the flying pterodactyl thing, and then a little walkway. See? Look at this. Yeah, I'm learning. I am... I am retaining information. Isn't it amazing? Don't? No, no, no. I'll retain your face if you do that again. Perfect. So this time, instead of going right, we'll go left. And see if there's anything we can... I mean, hopefully there's just like a nice jiggy. It's like up on something that we can just like grab. It's pretty idealistic, right? <laughs> oh, in a perfect world, the jiggies would just be there for us to take... Whenever we wanted. There's a jump thing right here. What is this? This is something interesting. Oh, that's right. I remember this. This is when we were on the way to Terry. We didn't go over here. But we can, we can go over here now. And we can go over here now. Don't look at me. All right, we're all flying. We're all sharing the sky. It's fine. <laughs> oh, there's room for all of us. It's huge. No need to, to assault any bear you see. 
Bonfire Cavern. What is this? Uh, things are on fire. Do we need to use ice eggs? Let me just poop one out real quick. Uh, no. See you later. That didn't work. There we go. Okay, I wasn't certain that that was going to work after it failed twice, but... Don't do that! No! You're going to send me down into the chasm. You bird? How could you? Disgusting lizard winged... Ugh. So disappointed in you, I don't even have the words to say. But thankfully it doesn't matter because we made it through whatever the heck this is and wherever the heck we're going. To a jiggy, right? Please, this will be uh, a very welcome acquisition. But it looks like that's not the case. Though we do get a warp point to come back to whatever the stopping planes are. And oh boy, more, more splitting upness that I'm not certain about. The stomping planes. Oh, no. We're going to have to avoid some feet, aren't we? That, yep. We certainly are. You can tell by the, by the music, right? Yeah, that's, that's foot avoidance music if I've ever heard one. Now, does the foot talk? We're going to get some, uh, some character development here. Is the foot going to speak? Stompadon. Triassic steamroller. No. It speaks in Morse code. <laughs> one stomp means screw off. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. We lost all of our life like that. What if we did it like this? Yeah, see you later, man. See you later. I'm going to wait for this to yellow. There we go. Yeah, no, this is, this has to be what they intended, right? Like, this is, I don't see any other way we could have got, gotten through this. My God. Terrifying. Oh, what? No, I should have known. I should have known. I should have known. We have to split up. Oh, well, think we can get this one. <laughs> this is the one that's most important. Uh, to get, If you get over here somehow with just Banjo, though, it sends you somewhere else? What is this? You go down somewhere. If you come over here as Kazooie as herself, you get the Jinjo. Interesting. Or alternately, we can go up the stairs and... I, maybe this just takes us back over to the beginning which would be kind of convenient it does it's convenient because now we can attempt it with uh, the two separate I'm going to try it with Kazooie first uh, if I can do this properly there we go uh, I'm going to do it with Kazooie first because she is faster I feel like this oh nope she's defecating sorry you gotta yeah, lighten up a little bit first I was, I was hoping that we could use the uh, invincibility wings just as herself, but that is not the case. Okay, so going as Kazooie is definitely a thing. Like, she is fast enough. Fascinating. And we got some health. I mean, the health doesn't actually help us at all. Since this thing takes away, like, all of our health. No! In one stomp. Oh god, I jumped right into it that time. So so Kazooie's dead. Is Banjo still alive? Are we both kind of... Kind of... Yeah, no, we're good. Cool. It just spawns us right here too, which is super convenient. I need to just time it up really well. Oh god. Okay, there we go. We're make, we gotta be a little bit more patient. This is something that I struggle with all the time. But now I'm, I'm forcing myself. The patience! Whoa, almost got stomped on there. And up, 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 up. Okay, cool. Now we can do this. We can free the Jinjo. Hello, buddy. You've been trapped here for God knows how long. I'm here to rescue you. Six of nine. Darn near close to 69. That's pretty nice. Oh, the Black Jinjos. Uh, now Banjo, my God. I don't, I don't have any idea how this is going to work. Banjo is not fast. We almost got stomped on right there. Really, I jumped up. Oh my god. Oh god, this is not off to a great start. <laughs> oh, buddy. Oh. So you can't even touch the, the foot, right? Like, I jumped into it and smashed my face. Oh, there it is. Yep, yep, knew that was coming. My god, his face has been flattened. How horrific. Now, does Kazooie stay over there? No. No? Alright, well, let's work on getting Banjo over there first this time. 
if it's even possible. Like we we may need a move that we don't even have. Can we do anything? No, we don't have any other moves. And up, oh, go 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 go. Yeah, there's no way. There's no way. Kazooie is way better at receiving the blows too than Banjo. Kazooie only takes two honeycombs of damage. Banjo is absolutely wrecked. Here I thought Banjo was a tough guy. Little did I know Banjo's allergic to feet. And that's fine because we got the Jiggy, right? And that's ultimately what we needed. Uh, I, I'm still very curious about what, what lies beyond that gate. Can we? Hold up. Where was this fell off like that? We can't like cheese this anyway. No, there's no way. We can't even like backflip up there. I was wondering like, can I just jump up that with Banjo and go over there? No. No, that's not a thing. Okay. Well, I don't know how we're going to get over there, but we're going to figure that out at another time. Right now, we're going to go back to the world entry just to uh, to kind of refresh the lay of the land. We're undoubtedly going to have to spend some more time in the air in order to obtain some more some more things there. Chiefly, the move that we need to, uh, to roost the eggs. What is our total at here? Are we at four? We are at four, so under 50%, which means we're going to spend another episode here that hopefully gets us to like seven or eight total. And that episode is going to happen next time. Yeah, kind of a awkward segue there, but hey, whatever, it works. So first off and foremost, thank you so very much for watching. I do appreciate it. I hope that you enjoyed yourself. And with that said, I look forward to... S oh, wait, what am I doing here? We're doing something else. Hold up. Don't go anywhere just yet. We got some stuff up here. <laughs> we, got, we got some exciting developments. Ladies and gentlemen, we have climbed the hill. We've gone through the cavern. We are getting assaulted. Great. Okay. Well, that doesn't help. I'll see you guys next time. Jesus. Criminy.